Yes, this is a competitive game of Overwatch. And no, you're not watching Bronze gameplay. This is actually high plat, low diamond, competitive Let's Overwatch. I'm not kidding you. How did we get here? Well, I need to take you to the beginning of this match. Well, for starters, I was, I was thinking that this was going to be a regular competitive game. But dear lord, I thought wrong. Okay, so we get the opening pick because Ryan made a mistake. But I end up making an even bigger mistake in a second. And I end up dying and that basically costs us control of the point right here. Whatever, mistakes happen. The enemy tank ends up making a switch. You know what, I could play into Warthog. Fine. I see a Torbjorn, I'm thinking, hey! I'm a tank player, I see an opportunity, surely I can go make a play, right? Surely! Hook, one shot, discord, that's yeah, your tank experience right there, honestly. honestly. But otherwise, nothing really happens here. Like, we lose this first point, whatever. But I still think, hey, this is absolutely a winnable game. You know why I think that? Because I end up putting a knife on the Torbjorn, pulling him, carnage, I can, even if... Even in this case, I still believe I can win this game, just because I believe I'm that good at the game. I believe I'm drinking green enough to be able to carry the game. I'm not saying my team is bad, they're actually really good. But you get what I'm saying, I can, I can be an X Factor that wins the game here. But for some reason, I end up getting extremely lost in what the hell the way went, and we take up a, and we end up doing an extremely weird fight, an extremely weird place in location. I say, fuck it, I'm gonna get mine. I have somehow in page 3, and then we just win this fight right here. But Torbjorn ends up capping the point, as you can see. But surely, nothing can go wrong here. Nothing can go wrong in this scenario, right? It's just one Torbjorn on point. Yes, this is act this is wasn't what I was seeing, but this is what the game is registering. You know why this is happening? Because the server is lagging like crazy. And it's not just me. It's everyone in the damn lobby experiencing this. Behold, peak competitive Overwatch. Because nobody ends up being able to play the game, and the other team already capped it, they just get the point for free. We're all very confused with what's happening. We have our teammates left. We're thinking, you know what? Maybe they just had McDonald's Wi-Fi and fetch the Blizzard servers. Maybe it was them that caused it. And you know what? They end up joining back. So maybe everything's fixed. Maybe it was just a one-off issue. Who knows? But me and Brick just decide to go crazy here. She gets a nano. Ash has a pick early on Torbjorn. We decimate the sim. And we get up opening picks. And then it happens again, as you can see. Nobody's able to play the game anymore at this point. I'll leave the future me to describe what happens, but you know what? You can see something ain't right with this lobby anymore. This isn't normal lag. Anyways, at this point, I start recording, and it's the beginning of a comeback story. I believe in Cinderella stories. I love comeback stories. Rooting for the underdog here. Me and Sojourn see the lone Zen. We go after them, the trans. We see that as an absolute W. Even though we're two, down two, I see the opportunity to win. I missed my ult, and we're able to somehow win the fight. But don't mind my shitty aim here, you know what? Uh, I'm working on my aim, okay? And... It starts lag again. Very bad. Very, very bad. It becomes somewhat difficult to actually, you know, get to point. But as you can see, the chat still works perfectly fucking fine. So this point is no longer the service. Someone in this lobby is lag switching. Wow, the way I said that is hella clickbaity. But yeah, someone in this lobby is a damn cheater. Now at this point, we're basically holding the same with trials. We don't know who is doing it. It could be anyone, it could be you, it could be you, it could be you, it could be you. We don't know who it is. Because the timing has so far worked in both teams' favor. There was one time where it lagged out in our favor, and there was another time where it lagged out in their favor. And again, we somehow 
are able to bring this back. Me and Brig wait for a cooldown. We bust out. Look at the soldier. Absolutely obliterate him. And we're able to cap point. Somehow. I don't know how we made alive during that entire change, but you know what? Everybody in the lobby was lagging out pretty bad. So that explains what that probably explains why I didn't die. And again, nobody knows who this is. Nobody knows who's lag switching here, because it's very obvious from the way it happens, it isn't random. It's when someone is when a team caps. And yeah, it's just everybody's at each other's throat here. At this point, I say it's winnable. We're down to BS, but Vodog uses his hook. I see three people. I carnage and ult. I get the soldier. And it's now winnable territory for us. I trace is already back in the fight. We get big anti, even though I get absolutely investigated here, because you know, that's the average tank experience. We still win the fight. I just gave up at this point. Last fight territory, possibly. I just ran back as Diva to counter swap. I didn't care. Fucking Moles is out the window at this point. Someone's lag switching the servers. It doesn't matter if I counter swap at this point. That's my least of my concerns. At this point, I believe there's a tipping point that allows us to win the game. Just absolutely deleting a load off from existence allowed us to win. That sleep anti and DM on that whole hog, I'm pretty sure won at that point. Because the Roadhog was no longer going to be present there. It literally would be missing a tank and we just collapse on the remaining squishies. And at this point, it's game over. Uh, we came back from a 3-0 in what should be a losable scenario. I have no idea, honestly, how we managed to win when they were lag switching. But you know what? It is what it is. I even get played in the game. Anyways, now that's over. I'll go ahead and let my past self take care of this. Alright, one of these motherfuckers was cheating. Hold on. There's no shot. It's like, I, I'm so conf That game was, um... It was interesting to say the least. Okay. So the first suspicion is on... Apparently because of the enemy. It's goddamn duck. Let me see here. I think it was a Torbjorn, honestly. They were playing like absolute dog shit. And their damage was way too high for how poorly they were playing. So, that's my two cents. But again, I think it's dub. They're constantly looking. I guess that's fine for right clicking and tracer, though. Damn, if only I got help a little bit sooner there, I would have you know, gotten that point. But damn. Alright, everything looks good so far. The thing is that it didn't start till a second. So I'm gonna go ahead and fast forward to second. Because that's when the lag switching started to happen. Hmm? Wait a second, what the hell? Wait, what? What are these fra- Oh, this is when it started to happen. This is when it started to happen. Okay, so it's not full dub. Dub's innocent here. Alright. My suspicion is on Torbjorn. Let's see the Torbjorn point of view here. Let me see. Okay, Torbjorn's also innocent here, looks like. And also, one of our DPS got DC'd, so it's definitely not them. So who the fuck is it then? Or is it just a service literally she in the bed? Dog, this shit looks ridiculous. What the fuck? Is it the road maybe? But no, road was saying shit, right? Maybe not. Uh, maybe it is, but I have fucking no clue here. Let me look at this Roadhog. Because I did dick on them first fight pretty badly. Okay, quick ending note real quick. They had to be mode enabled. The names are different in-game. They did say something in chat under a different name. So yeah, just 
Good to know. Okay, everything's looking normal. We need a rally here, right? Yeah, I need a rally. It's the Roadhog! It's the fucking Roadhog! He's just all tabbed right now! And there he goes, it's just lagging! It's the fucking Roadhog! Nah! It's the Roadhog! Nah! He all tabbed and then it fucking started happening! It's the fucking Roadhog! Look! There goes Torbjorn. There goes boom, all tab. Let's click all tab again. And then again. And then it's just, and then it happens. It's a fucking Roadhog. Hold on a second. Let me go back to the first fight. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. To where we fucking got decimated here. Hold on. Let me see here. AFK. Let's click the all tab back in the game. And then it starts happening. No one can withstand me. I think it's road. It's the, I'm like 99% certain it's Roadhog now. Cause oh yeah, it's Roadhog. Cause he <laughs> he just walked himself to point just very easily right now. But everybody else is struggling. Let's go ahead and uh, see what she let me see. Let's take uh, the Moira for example. Let's see how easy it is for them to get back to point. Random mass orb. They're looking in random direction. They don't know who they're shooting. Uh, yeah, it's not Moira. Cause not a thing. Still. Meanwhile, look how Roadhog is playing while basically everybody else in the lobby is dying. Like. They're very easily able to just turn and just two tap me and then hook in my exact direction. All headshots, by the way. I'm I'm very soon as road. When was the next one? It was the. I'm gonna keep watching this road. I'm pretty sure it's him. Then how did they lose this? Actually, if it is road, he must be shit at the game. Whoever was doing it is shit at the game for one. But like, how do we manage to win this fight even when they were fucking lag switching? Hold on. He walked off point and we're able to cap it. That's fucking amazing, honestly. <laughs> oh my god. Nah, that's crazy. That's actually crazy. Things don't and they're able to control it, but they can't, you know, actually use it because then it makes them fucked up too. The only people getting between this is the fucking turret and roadie so far. And there we go, everything's back to normal. I have nothing fucking happened. How do we win this fight? Road got anteed, Brig is a good support. And yeah. Alright, I'm gonna keep watching Road. I'm, I'm very certain it's him. Okay, so there's that hook. I managed to shout out. Let's see. We're still able to. Play. It's Roadhog! It's Roadhog! Yeah, it's Roadhog. It's so fucking easy. Holy shit. Smurfette looking ass! But yeah, they're all tapping way too much. And yeah. Mr. Hook. Okay. Now all tab, watch this. Yeah, it's Roadhog! It's Roadhog! It's fucking Roadhog! It's fucking Roadhog! Batman that bitch ass! Batman that bitch ass! I got me a YouTube video! I got me a thumbnail! 
Fuck you, Roadhog! I'm making content out of you! <laughs> and then they don't all tab here because they need the team table to win a fight, so they don't all tab and queue it, right? They don't do it here. Yep, they do. They, they, don't, they don't. Nice. Got that fucking read. That's unfortunate, Tracer. Unlucky, he just blinked right into a big pan. All tap, they got point control. But they can't, they can't all tap safety lit until he knows he has the full control. Or maybe he's not, because now we're on to him. That someone's obviously doing it on purpose. Literally, just a whole hog then that big dies. That, this little hog is shit. And you're shooting behind? What is this guy doing? Yeah, no wonder he had to fucking lag switch to win. No wonder. And that's EG. Smurfette, I had to say. Thank you for the free video, but also, fuck you, you shut the game, your parents don't love you, and I hope both sides of your pillow always stay warm at night. Ah, yeah, yeah, I was just trying to play some Overwatch, and yeah, that's an easy fucking report. If you ever get this fucking dude in game, fucking report his bitch ass. Absolutely, wait, hold on, can I add his battle net friend? That that might, can I get his battle tag? That'll be interesting if I do that. Actually, let me see if I can message him. That might be interesting. Hold on. There we go. I got the bell tag. There we go. Let's see if they accept my friend quest. And let's see if they want to defend themselves against these allegations. I might as well give them a fair chance, you know, defend themselves. Even though the evidence is pretty damn stacked against them. Once is a coincidence. Twice is very, 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 very sus, and three times is just way too fucking much. I'll give them, let's just say 10 minutes. I'll give them enough time. That's plenty of time to finish a game. God damn it, phone. That's plenty of time to finish a game. I sent my phone request, you know, see if I have anything to say. You know, I'll also invite to group. Just to give, yeah, okay, only invite from friends, so yeah, that, that's what I thought. <laughs> you have about three minutes left to defend yourself, otherwise, I'll take that as, you know, normally, means I go by innocent until proven guilty, but nah, your ass is fucking guilty. Well, I'm just gonna assume that Smurfette is not gonna accept my invitation to defend themselves. Because honestly, even if they did, they get their ass absolutely obliterated, so fucking hell. So if you see this guy in your ranked games from plat, high plat, diamond above, just absolutely obliterate them from existence. Just fucking, yeah, gameplay's just cheating. Absolutely dicked on. And that's the funny part. They were lag switching! They were cheating! And they still lost!